everyone, this is Quartzite Technology on the iPad, which is replacing uh, the whiteboard. So let me just go through the icons here of how this thing works and how fast it works. And the advantage is, is that you can actually put things onto a board so quick in a race, just like you would do in a timeout or even before or after games when you want to run plays. So anytime you want to actually change the court, you can go full court, half court. Okay, if I want to put guys on the court that fast, as fast as you could type, that's how fast you can actually put things on a court. So if I want, I can put the ball here. I can then take the ball, throw it to this guy. I can have him cut through. This guy can come across. He can set a pick. He can come over here. We can try to get him the ball. And then if I even hit this, you hear the audio? He scores, okay? Now, you say, all right, need play. Hit play. Bang. It will now play the play right over. You're going to see the plays. I don't have to touch a thing. You can talk through this through your players. It saves everything immediately. You see the pass. He cuts through over there, sets a pick, comes across, score. Now, if you wanted to do it at your own speed, go right back. You can talk to a player through it. Say, hey, you know something, Bob? When you cut through, all right, Bob, when you cut through, you got to be make sure you're close to this guy. For number four, you got to set a pick, okay? You can see how neat that is, gang, where you can do it at your own speed, as fast as you want to go, or go all the way to the end, however you want to do this, okay? Hit the back button. Okay, we come right back to our screen. These buttons right here, so again, what you're doing, let's say pretend I did this and I moved this guy from here to here. What this button does, Okay, well first off, this button, I'll show you the back button. It's just a back button. It just takes you back, all right? So if you actually threw a pass and a pass and you wanted to back that up, just go back. It just backs it up. Let's pretend we ran a play, though. We did this. We did this cut through, okay, and we ran the play we just ran. And let's say this time we're trying to throw it to the guy breaking into the elbow right here, all right? Now, let's say, let's say the coach loves that set. You hit this, it takes you right back to your original set. That's what's really cool. Come right back to it. If you're running an offense out of this set, you can do it every time. Or if you go, nope, brand new set, just do this. You got a brand new set again, okay? What's neat about these two features as well, these two buttons, you can actually have the players. I know with especially lower level, you want to be able to point out who's playing the two, who's playing the three, who's playing the four, who's playing the five. All right. Well, one of the other neat features about this is sometimes in game mode, you just want to put players without remembering to put them in order. Double tap that. Now you're in game mode. That's what I call game mode. Now it's just X's and O's. And you can put the defense any way you want. Okay. And throw the ball wherever you want and take it from there. So X's and O's, or you can go either one of these things you can tap and you, who's playing the one, two, three, however you like to do this. Okay. Playbook, real simple. These are the playbooks, folks, of virtually um, of, of all the plays we actually have running. So I did the major playbook, which has all the plays. For example, this was this past weekend. We had a tournament in Charlotte. These were all the things we did just during timeouts before the game and after game. We go back and we review them. This one right here, that are the specific plays we wanted to make sure we ran for this game. They're already saved. So when we call the timeout, for example, we wanted to run T. They were playing us on the man-to-man -man defense. We actually ran this. We said, all right, you guys, you guys got to come up around the pick. Make sure, the, make sure you're setting good picks. The guard comes across it. And we're just running the play. I'm not going to do the whole play, but you get an idea. This is running real time live. You ever come back, do a new play, you're right back to it again. Or go to a half court. As fast as you could put your fingers down, guys, and move these guys, as fast as you can do it, it saves it no matter what. You can move these guys wherever you want. It's that fast. You mess up, there's no more race, there's no more racing. Boom. Right there, you're right back to it. Okay, and it automatically saves it in real time. Finally is, you actually have this type of thing where you can go through this, but very simply is you could change the court service from wood to white. Okay, you could do that. Uh, go back to here, and I really like the wood look. Absolutely, you know, I think most people do. Um, you can also come back to court lines. They can be black, they can be white. Player markers, you can either have them all numbered, or um, you can have default, however you want it. X's, O's, all numbered, some numbered, however you like to do that. Um, or the court image. This is kind of neat. Just let you know, you can pick any photo you want out of your photo library, throw it in there, and it's going to put the court image right on the court. So that's kind of cool as well. And finally, you have the speed of the playback. Uh, you have autosave and speed of the playback. The speed, you can move this thing up. Give an example. It's really fast, folks. If you want it to be that fast, um, that's why I like to do it manually. But give you an idea. You move it to here. Let's go to my store plays. And let's, for example, I'm going to run T. And watch how fast this goes on this. I mean, they, they fly. You can see that's pretty quick, all right? So you can obviously adjust it, but you can see when you run things really quick, really quick, you get to do it whenever you'd like. So there it is, courtside technology, the ability to do whatever you want as fast as you want. You want to break the press, and they're doing this kind of press to you. Well, whatever you want to do, folks, you can lay it all out. At the end of the day, it makes it fast. And here's maybe the neatest thing. Your, your kids absolutely love it. They pay attention more than they ever thought they would. Have fun with it. Courtside technology.